cold one for the boys in the morning because it's six something in the morning on a Saturday. Okay guys, so um, I just got back from work, heading over to the car wash station because tonight we're going to a truck meet. Um, it's going to be a good time, it's for a good cause for weight. Raise awareness for autism. I can speak today, it'd be nice. But, anyways, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go head over that way after we get the truck washed up and run a few errands and whatnot. It's really dirty. Your truck is so gross. Alright, guys, I got my buddy Elmer in front of me. But eat his asshole. The stupid 400 can't freaking drive. Then we got in front of him is an L. I think it's an LML Duramax. I, got, I can't tell because I can't see the front end of it. Um, and then we got my buddy Matt and his Ram 1500. So we got a little bit of a convoy heading this way. Of course, me, we've got already some people here. I think this is just the first batch of people. There's not many people, looks like, over there. Um, so hopefully we'll find a good parking space. We'll walk around, talk to some people. You gonna be the official trucks and water puppy for the video? Hi. Hi, dear. Hi, dear. I don't ask for a lot. Oh, but... <laughs> you're so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> That's my belt buckle. <laughs> Hi, dear. <laughs> How much prep goes into one picture? Oh yeah. <laughs> I am. Yeah 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 yeah. Matt, take off your shirt and run around. Huh? Take off your shirt and run around. Take off my shirt and run around. Yeah. Truck Truck Don't fit me. Hi, what's your name, truck slut? Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> we ain't doing that, fuck you. <laughs> Come on. What do you want me to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? The truck beats me. So we pretty much almost have almost every generation of Duramax in this one thing. Yeah, if Elmer was still here. Yeah. Thank you all again for everyone that came out um, to the Autism Awareness Truck Meet. It was an awesome time, guys. Thank you all so much for your um, support and the donations and everything like that. Um, it was a great time. Saw a lot of awesome trucks, a lot of um, builds going on, stuff like that. So just, it was just a great time in general. So I want to thank you all so much. So right now it's Sunday. I'm about to go pick up my girlfriend. We're going to have to pitch it forward to Gatlinburg. I don't know what we're going to do yet. But, um... Yeah, we're going to do that, and then uh, we'll um, 
of course bring you all along for the ride. When people ask me, is it, well, what's it like to drive a K1500? Well, Is she drinks a little bit of fuel, especially on the new wheels and tires. Not much more, but she drinks a little bit more fuel. So I just got we got back from Bass Pro. Um, I used my Bay's gift card for my birthday to buy me this new hat. Like I need any more hats, but you know I like hats. So I uh, this is one to the collection too. Well, I could help with your addiction. What did you get, babe? I got a candle. She got it's really, really cute. It's, it's a very like, it smells really good. Why does it smell like babe? I don't even know. It smells like you, babe. Okay, thanks. Oh, you get brownie points, boys. Anyways, it looks like this. Look how cute the candle is. Yeah. So adorable, but you're cuter. It smells like pancakes. Pink? Yeah. A little bit of appleness to it. A little bit of appleness, okay. But anyways, so we're about to head to Pigeon 4 and play some mini golf because she wants to practice more since Daytona. Hey. We don't need to already trash talk. Okay. Well, I'm not trash talking. I'm just speaking the truth. Okay. Well, fuck you. She loves me, guys. Anyways, um, so yeah, we're gonna head up there, probably get some dinner and stuff and whatnot, and just kind of hang out for the rest of the day. Hey, go I want to go to the island, too. Yeah, she wants to go to the island. And then we're gonna head home at a decent hour, because I got stuff I gotta do tonight. She's got stuff she's gotta do tonight, so... It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a fun day. Day to Hannah's, and we played mini golf, so babe, who won? I did. Technically, she won. Technically, yeah, because listen, okay, it was 60 to 60, but Goof, Goofy Goober over here, he like hit the ball and it went in like the water. So, technicality, I think that's automatic disqualification. So, I won. What do you think? Actually, we play Rock Paper Scissors, she beat me at Rock Paper Scissors, that's how she won. Yeah, but my, what I said kind of makes more sense. No, it doesn't. I'm not arguing with you about some petty crap like you want to. There's a new thing over there. Oh, wow. Over there. Wow. Yeah, okay. There's a lot of new stuff going in Gallenberg, guys, after all the fires. Oh, there's mini golf over there. That looks like you have to do a lot of climbing. Yeah, that looks cool. Yeah, it does. Oh, Gallenberg, what a tourist trap. And all y'all are spending a shit ton of money to do nothing. I just like going through the mountains. Yeah, same. What she said. I'm always right. Cry daddies. That's the video band of that museum right over there. Which one? That, the car one. Yes. It's pretty cool. I know, it's awesome. Okay. Paul Walker's GTR was in there when he died, and I got to stand next to him and touch it, and I cried a little bit. Oh. I had a moment. I just said, there's some robots. I don't like robots. So she much. does not like robots whatsoever. Like, whatsoever, she does not like robots. They're I don't creepy. blame her. They're creepy. Shit. They're creepy. The place that we went to today, it has some creepy robots, so not. Those are just weird. So we're up here in the Smokies. We're trying to get a nice picture and everything. But all of a sudden, like, 20 people just showed up. So the that. I mean, yeah, I guess. But no, it's time to merge out of here and fight our way back down the mountain. Yeah, it's happening again. Yeah. On the actual road, not on the on the beach. Yeah. We're on an actual road. It's pretty great. No. I'm having a major heart attack every three seconds. I'm not doing bad. I made my almost at fifty. Huh? Hey. Oh, Guys, I, I I don't know how to feel about this. Alright guys, um, we haven't rode through Fox Toyota in a while, so I'm going to ride through here quick to see if they have anything new in inventory that we can might come over and test drive and look at. Because, you know, that's just what we do. Um, let's see here. What do they got? What do they got? So we've got a, uh, we got a flatbed now, a Ram 2500 flatbed, not 2500, it's a 3500, sorry. That, no, the other 2500 has got rush problems on the bed. Um... LT-1500 with tow mirrors, LT-1500 with tow mirrors, that's 2500, sorry. They're both 25 and 3500, okay. And the Z71 off-road, 
um, Duramax. It looks like they're all Duramax right there. So you're rolling through here. We got an FJ. Tundra. 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 Z71 off-road. 1500. 1500 4x4. 1500 4x4. That's about it. They're kind of low on some inventory. Hmm. A lot of fit 25 and 3500s though. Huh. Interesting. I also want to say this. I was at the gas station just a few minutes ago getting gas. And there's a car parked in front of me. And I went there and I was there for about three to four minutes getting gas, you know, putting the gas in the truck. Owners never came out. Finally, they come out after they went inside. I'm just going to say this. If you know you're going to be in there for more than two or three minutes, Move your car forward into a parking spot. Don't block the pump so no one else can get in or out. I mean, that's kind of just rude in general, really. Unless there's, like, no one there. But it's, a pretty, it's been pretty busy this afternoon, it looks like, there. So, I don't understand people. I don't understand why. They just can't be, like, just take time out. They, like, take the 30 seconds out of their day to move it 40 feet forward into a parking space. But that's just me.